Naval War Arctic Circle is a real-time strategy game. Uh, it's set in 2030 and uh, you fight enemy naval and aerial forces with uh, units such as airplanes and uh, submarines and uh, units like that. We have uh, two full single-player campaigns, uh, Russia and uh, what used to make up NATO. And of course you can play uh, multiplayer. The game is accurate in how naval wars are for today. It's important that you investigate what kind of target you have ahead because the uh, target might be a civilian plane or neutrals. The environment is also important in naval war because there's storms and rain and sometimes fog and those things will affect your technologies. The uh, two factions are uh, Russia and NATO and Russia they rely more on their few but very powerful ships as well as submarines and uh, their uh, land-based uh, air force. They don't have the sheer number of ships as the other factions have. Instead they have their uh, large number of uh, long-range bombers and uh, effective area denial weapons. NATO is balanced and structured around their carrier battle group and every ship must at all costs defend their aircraft carrier but at the same time they have to be offensive. You have to be offensive to win a war.